The billionaire SpaceX CEO is launching satellites into orbit and promising to deliver high-speed broadband internet to as many people as possible. When you think of billionaire entrepreneur Elon Musk, chances are good that you think of his electric car company Tesla, his space exploration venture SpaceX or his stint hosting Saturday Night Live. Maybe you just know him as one of the richest people on Earth. Something you might be less familiar with is a venture of Musk's called Starlink, which aims to sell internet connections to almost anyone on the planet by way of a growing network of private satellites orbiting overhead. Okay, start at the beginning, what is Starlink, exactly? Technically a division within SpaceX, Starlink is also the name of the spaceflight company's growing network, or constellation, of orbital satellites. The development of that network began in 2015, with the first prototype satellites launched into orbit in 2018. In the years since, SpaceX has deployed over 1,000 Starlink satellites into orbit across dozens of successful launches. In January, for its first Starlink mission of 2021, SpaceX launched 60 satellites into orbit from Kennedy Space Center using the landable, relaunchable Falcon 9 orbital rocket. Subsequent launches, the most recent of which delivered another 60 satellites into orbit on May 26, have brought the total number of satellites in the constellation up to 1,737, though some of those satellites are prototypes or non-operational units that aren't functioning parts of the network. And those satellites can connect my home to the internet. That's the idea, yes. Just like existing providers of satellite internet like HughesNet or Viasat, Starlink wants to sell internet access, particularly to people in rural areas and other parts of the world who don't already have access to high-speed broadband. Starlink is ideally suited for areas of the globe where connectivity has typically been a challenge, the Starlink website reads. Unbounded by traditional ground infrastructure, Starlink can deliver high-speed broadband internet to locations where access has been unreliable or completely unavailable. All you need to do to make the connection is set up a small satellite dish at your home to receive the signal and pass the bandwidth onto your router. There's even a Starlink app for Android and iOS that uses augmented reality to help customers pick the best location and position for their receivers. How fast is Starlink's internet service? Users can expect to see data speeds vary from 50 to 150 megabits per second and latency from 20 to 40 milliseconds in most locations over the next several months, Starlink's website says, while also warning of brief periods of no connectivity at all. As we launch more satellites, install more ground stations and improve our networking software, data speed, latency and uptime will improve dramatically. Just to double its top speeds to 300 megabits per second by the end of 2021. How much does Starlink cost? Starlink has begun accepting pre-orders from customers interested in joining the company's better than nothing beta program. The cost of the service is billed at $99 per month, plus taxes and fees, plus an initial payment of $500 for the mountable satellite dish and router that you'll need to install at home. Where is Starlink available? Despite promising to blanket the entire globe in coverage by this fall, Starlink service is currently limited to select regions and select countries, but the coverage map will grow considerably as more satellites join the constellation. Per Musk, the list of countries currently serviced by the growing network of low-Earth orbit satellites includes the US, Canada, the UK, France, Germany, Austria, the Netherlands, Ireland, Belgium, Switzerland, Denmark, Portugal, Australia, and New Zealand.